If you have just completed the first, second or third year of your engineering, this video is just for you. You are at the point where relatives would randomly call your parents and ask, Are, bachche ka internship to lagi gaya hoga? And if you are one of those people who could not back an internship due to whatever reasons, why don't you try applying for a research internship at IITs or IIMs? I have broken down the application process in six easy to follow steps which have helped me and my juniors score a research internship at IITs like Delhi, BHU and Dhanbad and IIMs like Ahmedabad and Bangalore. So let's begin Sidi Baat No Bakwas. Step 1. Choose your domain. Selecting your domain or your niche is the first and the most important step in any research. And why is that? तो समझिए कि आप अभी जो भी टॉपिक सेलेक्ट करेंगे उसमें आपको बहुत ज़्यादा टाइम इन्वेस्ट करना पड़ेगा और अगर वो टॉपिक आपके आगे जाके करियर में काम नहीं आया तो फिर ये टाइम वेस्ट ही समझिए तो कुछ ऐसा टॉपिक चुनना ज़रूरी है जिसमें आपको इंटरेस्ट हो और आगे जो आपके करियर में काम आए नंबर टू आप जिस भी प्रोफेसर को मेल करेंगे ना तो वो प्रोफेसर उसी को सिलेक्ट करेगा जिसे उस डोमेन में इंटरेस्ट हो और उसकी वैल्यूबल नॉलेज हो and before the uh, before selecting you for the internship he will definitely take a uh, telephonic interview with you and in that interview he will assess your abilities and your interest in the topic so if you are faking it let me tell you fake it till you make it does not work when it comes to research how to find your domain easy go to any iit website say iit bombay now open the faculty directory Search for your department. My department is mechanical, so I'm searching that. Now look, there are hundreds of professor faculty information available, all for free. So, अब तुमने कभी सोचा भी नहीं होगा कि मैं ऐसा कहूँगा. But you have to stalk the professors. Basically, stalk their prof profiles, stalk their research, stalk their previous experiences, case studies, whatever they are. So, what I check basically is their previous researches to get an idea. Uh, suppose that I see. Few professors are working on fluids and I have an interest on fluids. So that is basically my domain. I can work on it and I can approach the professor to, you know, hire me or to take me, select me for the internship. Step number two, design the best version of your CV. Now, when I say the best version, I mean the best looking, the best professional version of your CV that instantly catches the eye of the professor and he instantly replies to you. So, you have to make sure a few things. First, make sure your CV is no longer than one page. Nobody has really interest in reading an encyclopedia about you. So, keep it short, just like a movie trailer, keep the best bits only. Baki interview ke liye bacha kar Make sure all the softwares related to your domain and your interest are mentioned in the CV. Suppose, fluids ke research mein professors answers use karte hain, to I would definitely mention mention answers on my CV. Now, if you want a detailed video on how exactly to design a professional looking CV, do comment below and I will also make a video on that. But yeah, do comment. And like and subscribe my channel if you like so far. Step number four, write a personalized and eye-catching cover letter now here is the exact thing where most students grow, go wrong they focus on their qualifications in the cover mail too much and not on how they can contribute towards the project professor ko kya chahiye ki jo bachcha ho wo uske project pe acche se kaam kare aur uska kaam jaldi se ho jaye so he will look for a person who can actually add value to the project and has some talent and does not require you know special training to complete the project so Always write in as perspective of the professor. Begin with a salutation like Dear Professor XYZ with their uh, with their last name so that it looks personalized. It looks like you are only approaching him. So out of you know like 150 emails that he gets every day, it gets filtered out and your email will be the first to be seen by him. Step number four. Do not attach your resume but hyperlink it. Let me tell you why, why I'm saying that. When you attach a resume, most professors who get like tons of emails every day, they have applied a, scam, uh, a spam filter where if anything like resume or CV is attached to the, uh, to the mail, that will automatically get filtered out to the spam folder. You don't want that. You want him to see it. So attach the resume by hyperlinking it instead of you know attaching it as an attachment in the email 
स्टेप नंबर फाइव स्केड्यूल इज वॉट मेक्स यू स्टैंड आउट ना यू प्रॉबली थिंकिंग दैट स्केड्यूल से क्या फ़ायदा लाइक like, कभी भी भेजो इट्स अ मेल कभी भी पहुँच जाएगा नो इट्स नॉट लाइक दैट थिंक ऑफ इट एज अ ह्यूमन परस्पेक्टिव द प्रोफेसर इज ऑल्सो ह्यूमन एंड इफ यू सेंड इट ऑन द वीकेंड ही विल नेवर चेक इट आउट इफ यू सेंड इट एट नाइट ट्वेल्व ए एम और वन ए एम ही विल नेवर चेक इट आउट सो द बेस्ट ऑप्टिमम टाइम टू सेंड एन ई मेल फॉर इंटर्नशिप इज ट्यूजडेज एंड वेडनेसडेज अराउंड एन ए एम टू ट्वेल्व पी एम वाई आई एम सेंग दिस इज बिकॉज यू नो on even on mondays the professor you know has just started the week and is not in the mood to you know check all the mails so keep it from tuesday to wednesday uh schedule it that's better so if you do that he will definitely definitely see it and reply to it uh i have i have sent tons of mails where you know i had sent it on sunday and never got a reply and i had sent it on tuesday and always got a reply so it makes a huge difference just follow this step step number 6 follow up with the professor now once you get a reply that is not the end you have to make sure you back the internship so what you do is you reply to them again whatever they are asking suppose they are asking for a date for a telephonic interview they are asking for some kind of test you make sure that you reply them within time and that is the only way that you can get an internship agar koi bhi point samajh mein na aaye to niche comment mein likh do aur agar kisi bhi point ko detail mein explain karna hai to wo bhi comment mein likh do be it cover letter be it the cv anything aur uh, resume kaise attach karna hai wo bhi agar puchna hai to uh, comments mein likh do baki i'll make more videos more such educational videos on <clears throat> on this placement series so stay tuned subscribe right now and see you later keep blooming